And the last law of exponents we want to review is a power of a power. a to the n, then to the exponent m, keep the base the same a, and multiply our two exponents, n times m. Why? 2 to the third, 2 to the third to the exponent 4 means 2 to the third or this four times. 1, 2, 3, 4. That means we have a total of 12 twos and a repeated multiplication, which is 2 to the 12th, or 3 times 4. Examples, x to the third, again to the power 3, we would do 3 times 3. If we were to write it out, we would have 3x's, 3x's, and 3x's, so 9x's in a repeated multiplication, so x to the ninth. x to the 1 to the exponent 3 would be x to the 1 times 3. 3x's three in a repeated multiplication, x to the third. a to the power 2 to the power 5, 2a's in a repeated multiplication 5 times, would give us a total of 10 a's or 2 times 5. And order of the exponents isn't important because if we look at a to the 5 then to the 2, it would be 5 a's in a repeated multiplication twice. So again, for a total of 10 a's because 5 times 2 is the same as 2 times 5.